Can you go a little lower? Can I go lower? <laughs> What's going on, y'all? What's good, Radicals? It's your boy, Rad in the building. Y'all know the vibes. We back at it again with that Become a rock star. Hit that like button for your boy and subscribe if you haven't already. Let's get right up into this. So we show up at Shorty Door again, and it's a new girl. Like I said, is it the third? Did she bring us a third? So let's go see. So who the hell is this, madam? Anything I can help you with? Sorry, I'm looking for Selena. She lives here, right? Oh, you came to see Selena. She didn't mention that someone was coming to see her today. Very strange considering how persistent she's been all day. Um, I'm sorry to ask, but who the fuck are you? <laughs> it's okay. My name is Rosa and I'm Selena's mother. Mother? You look, hold on, you look incredibly too young to be Selena's mother. Ain't no way. You playing with me. You playing with me right now. You messing with me right now. You ain't, you ain't Selena's mother. Oh. Haha, <laughs> don't worry, it's okay. I'll call her. Selena, baby, come here, please. One moment. You have to wait a bit. It's okay. And you're, and you're her friend, right? Well, I guess you could say that. My name is Kurt. Kurt Cobain. Sorry, Kurt, it's just like, I've never heard of you before. That's not surprising. I know Selena, <laughs> we met recently. Yeah, something like yesterday. And we got it there on site. You know what I'm saying? I understand. <clears throat> Mom, you called me? Yes, dear. You have a visitor. Visitor? Oh. See, this is the kind of look is, oh, I forgot my mom's in town and I, I forgot he was coming over. Look. This is a look like, oh, shit. Uh, what am I supposed to do now? This is a look like, oh, you shouldn't even be here at this moment because my mom just popped in out of nowhere. But I, I get it, I get it. You had a long day and you just probably came home, seen your mom right there. She probably got the house key and all that. I dig it, I dig it. Right, yeah, right. I can handle this on my own. Thanks for opening up, mom. Of course. Oh, wait, I have a great idea. I don't like the sound of that. Honey, since we were just about to have dinner, why don't you invite your friend to keep us company? Definitely not. Mom, I'm sure he has a lot to do. I'm sorry, but Selena's right. I don't think that's a good idea. I don't want to hear anything. No objections are accepted. I'll leave you two alone for a while, but I want you both at the table in 10 minutes. You're not my mom. Like, what? All right, all right, mom and law Rosa. Okay. Mommy Rosa. Rosa is gone, leaving you and Selena alone. Wow, did that just happen? I'm sorry about the show. She showed up here unannounced, and I didn't have time to warn you. See, I already knew. I already knew the vibe. It was so much of a surprise to me as it was to you. That's really unlikely. Look, I know you don't owe me anything, but could you do what she asked? Just one little dinner? And why would she ask me to do that? Besides, after dinner, mom will leave and we'll be alone and we could do something. Nice. You got me. You, you got me, Selene. You know what I'm saying? You got me. Yeah, you, you got me that for sure. All right, since you said that and you giving me these looks, you giving me these looks like that? I guess, I guess I could stay for then, then. And then have dessert afterward. <laughs> I guarantee you won't regret it. Really? Yes. The truth is, I wouldn't mind a meal right now. Ah, what the hell? YOLO. YOLO, okay. <laughs> Okay, they were they with the slang in this game. Okay, okay, deal. But if your mom doesn't leave after dinner, I'll leave instead. Fair enough. When you enter the apartment, you notice Rose and Selena in front of the table. Kurt, please sit down. Make yourself at home. Yes, make yourself comfortable. Hey, if you don't mind me, you know, if I if I had a, a little napkin, put that right right here. You you know I don't, I don't see nobody eat like that. I ain't never seen nobody like that. Put put a little napkin. Tuck it in, they sh in front of their shirt. Y'all eat like that? Because I definitely don't eat like that. You know, like, I don't know what the... Put that outside, that joint tuck right there. You know, a little dib dab. I ain't never seen that before. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> yes, thanks. You sat at the table where everything was already set for you. Why y'all both grilling me like that? 
I found some meat. Oh, all right, let me take this off. Hold on. All right. Let me, let me take that off. Yeah, yeah, I need to see the eyeballs. Why are these two looking at me like that? Her mom, I don't know about her mom, though. Now that she's looking at me like that, she's looking like a damn snake. I'm sorry. But Selena, on the other hand, I, I feel like they both got some questions they got to ask me. I feel like the mother especially, so she might as well go ahead and ask some questions. Bon appetit, everyone. Enjoy your meal. Enjoy your meal. So, Kurt, tell me how do you know Selena? See, I already knew. I knew the questions was coming. We need to say some great. We need to say grace. Like, bless the food or something. Good question. Well, mom, baby, you never tell me anything anyway. Can't your friend at least share the story? If you don't want to, you don't have to tell her. Oh, <laughs> I'm a teller, all right. No, it's not unusual. In fact, it's kind of corny, actually. Really? Yes, I live next door, and one morning we just happened to be talking on the street. Now we see each other once in a while. That's interesting. By the way, Selena, I hope you don't mind if I crash at your place tonight. But mom, I actually have plans too. Don't worry, I won't bother you. Here we go. I knew from the start that agreeing to this dinner was a bad idea. Oh, well, you could stay. Suddenly you felt someone's leg under the table. Whose leg, whose leg are you going to be, yo? That would be some shit if that was the Mama Rose's leg. That would be some craziness. I ain't going to lie. Hey, hey, what the hell? Is this, is this girl out of her mother her mind? So, Kurt, may I ask why you came here today? Mm, what? I asked you, asked you why you came here today. Yeah, just come on, pull yourself together. I just, yes? I just wanted to discuss something with Selena. Oh, I understand. I hope not interrupted too much. Lady, you are in the definition of interrupt. It basically cock blocking me. No, not at all. Oh, God. All right, I'm going to have to blur this all out, you know what I'm saying? Rosa asked you something. You quickly replied, absolutely not delving into the question itself. Okay, act normal. Get yourself together, Kurt. You know what I'm saying? Otherwise, this lady will definitely suspect something. Then it's unlikely that all this will end well. You look close. Yes. Yo, Selena. Selena. Yo. I got I to put these on. That might be the dumb, you know? I, that might be the... Yo. Oh, no, don't give me the mods, man. I don't get... Yo, when a girl do this, she got your soul. Simple as that. Simple as that. Yeah, she loves it. Loves it. She's insane. Hey, Kurt, is everything okay? Hey, yo, everything is fine. Yeah, Kurt, are you okay? What? Why do you ask? You just have such a weird look on your face. Fuck. Oh, it's... I just thought I was gonna sneeze. Don't worry. I'm good. What the fuck? I said, what the fuck? God. Why did she stop? I almost... Oh, I know if you really want to sneeze, but you can't. It's better to go to the bathroom and watch. Well, or in the case of emergency, just sneeze there. It would be so much better than doing it at the table. Did she just send me to the bathroom to finish what she started? This is a demon. This is what you call a demon. With a capital D. What a bit. Um, if you want to wash the bathrooms right down the hall, first door on the left. Yo, why are you saying it like this is your crib? Why can't you just let Talina show me or escort me to there? You know what I'm saying? Thanks. First door on the left, I'll remember. Well done, Kurt. You knew you didn't have to stay. But no. Oh, to hell to... To hell with the whole Red family. Better just go home now. Oh, you just washing your face? What a pity. And for some reason, I was hoping to catch you doing something completely different. Oh, really? And what was it you wanted me to do? Exactly. Selena? Come on, you're a smart boy and you already figured it out. Or maybe you're mad at me. Fuck. I'm having a hard time holding back. Hey, y'all. Alright, y'all. I'm on... Fast forward, you know what I'm saying? Hey, hey, hey. Okay, all right. Let me, let me catch up up, catch y'all up on game real quick. Let me speed y'all up because I had to skip past, you know. I had to skip past that part for the YouTube purpose. You know what I'm saying? Patreon on the way. I play this game down the line. You know what I'm saying? Uncensored. But yo, they gave us a choice: be gentle or be rough. Hey man, no one be. I'm like yo. 
since you want to toy around, we're going to be rough. We, we was rough, you know what I'm saying? That intrigued her. She wasn't expecting all that out of us. You know what I'm saying? So now she want to know more about Kurt. Now at the end of it, we get here. When Selena finally recovered, he went outside. First thing you know is coming out of the bathroom was Rosa walking down the corridor. How much did Mama Rosa know about? It? How much did she watch? Did she watch the whole thing? Did she hear everything? She giving that sly look like she wants some of Kurt too. I see why y'all recommended this game, but this game was on some freaky, freaky, dicky, 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 dicky shit. You know what I'm saying? This look right there said, yo, I need to try whatever my daughter. That's that type of look she got in her. That's that look right there. That little side eye. Wait a second. Was she just? No, it's just a coincidence. Mm, are you okay? Yeah, fine. I just thought I saw something. All right, well, head back to the table. What about you? I told my mom I was going to go to my room for a little while, so I'll come over later. Yeah, I don't think we can fool anyone, anyone this way. Especially after seeing a mother right there. Whatever, I don't care. Kurt, you weren't in too much of a hurry. Why is she looking like that, though? Why is she pop? Yo, yo, what is going on, man? Kurt Cobain got the motherfucking. That's what it is. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. I'm not feeling well. Oh, Selena went to her room for a while. Well, then, could you give me her apologies and explain that situation? I think I better go home. Yes, certainly. Oh, I gotta have my phone in my hand. I hope I hope the static ain't noise ain't. You know what I'm saying? I hope you feel better soon. Thanks for everything and for a wonderful dinner, of course. Come again. <laughs> if you don't mind, I'll come up again and again and again. Next morning. Hmm. Nice night's sleep. Ding ding. Every morning. Who is this? Naturally, I'm not surprised anymore. It's Jacob. Hey, man, how's your morning? Well, it's hard to say anything about it. It's just getting started. <laughs> You're irritable every morning. Be positive. I'll try. Is there any news? Not really, although I may have found us the last group member. Oh, you're not sure yet? Yeah, I'll have to meet them and discuss some details. And I gather from your tone, you want to go alone. Yep, so far it's too complicated to bring you along, and I'll, I'll probably be busy all night after that. I think we can talk about it tomorrow. Got you, bro. Yeah. What are you going to do? Hey, man, I'll probably go to my sister's office. It's been too long since I've seen her. Really? Well, good luck. You too. The fourth member of the band sounds intriguing. Fuck, I'd even ask him if it was a guy or a girl. All right. I don't see the point in rushing ahead. If Jacob's going to tell me tomorrow, well, the first thing I need to do is take a shower. Yeah, you, you little nasty ass. Hope you took a shower when you got home. Sometime later, you decided to visit your sister. She's probably in her office as usual. We get to see what Kurt this looks like. It's been a long time since I've been in this office. The last time was probably about six months ago. But I remember exactly how to get to my sister's office. You opened the door to the office and stood on the threshold. Jane? What the hell is you doing in Julia's office? Kurt? What are you doing here? Looks like she didn't expect to see me here either. I have the same question for you. I was actually looking for Julia. If memory serves, it's still her office, isn't it? Jane came out from behind the table and stood in front of you, looking like a little snizzack. Of course, I forgot that you don't talk to her, so you don't know anything. Again, these secrets. You know what? That Julie is currently on a business trip and I'm replacing her. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Replacing her in her office is kind of weird. And yet, it's the case. Besides, she didn't mind. Hell, I just noticed how gorgeous Jane looked in that suit. Especially her. You know, um... Bam. Look, Kurt, with Julia going, I have a lot of work to do. I love to talk with you longer, but I don't have the luxury of free time right now. So I'll ask you straight out. Is there anything I can do to help you? No, you can't get rid of me that easily. Are things really that bad? Believe it or not, the truth is that everything is just fine. I can't tell if it's sarcasm or if she's serious. Noticing that you were in a hurry to leave Jane's side warily. You're not leaving until you know everything, are you? If you want, I can listen to a short version. Okay. Like I said, things are going pretty well. We've got a big deal coming up. Plus the expansion, but the deadlines are almost to the limit. I hardly sleep anywhere but in this room, and Julia goes abroad. I would give my soul to sit quietly and drink a good wine. All right, that's all. You got to go. I've already been too open with you. 
bottle of wine. Well, that could be arranged. You just have to go to the store. He went to the store and bought a bottle of wine sometime later. What kind of wine he bought? Some Stella Rosa? You know what I'm saying? You knocked on Jane's office door and without waiting for an answer, you went inside. As I thought, even at this late hour, she's still swamped. She's so wrapped up in paperwork, she doesn't even look to see who's in. Jane. What? Oh, it's you, Kurt. What are you doing here so late? I thought I'd check on you. Well, as you can see, I'm on the same page. Jane really leaned back in her chair and began to stare in your direction. Hey, what are you holding there? I'm holding here this love potion in my hand, you know what I'm saying? I'm about to give it to you. I'm going to fall deeply in love with Kurt. Everything's going to be on fine. Everything's going to be fine for you. Bottle of wine? Yes. And why did you bring it here? What stupid question? Woman, I figured you could use a little break from all the work. I told you I, could get, I could, couldn't be distracted. Too much to do, remember? Look at the clock. I think you had enough for one day. Come on, give me the glasses. I know Julia keeps them in here somewhere. For a few seconds, you look into Jane's eyes, seeing her wobble. Come on, when is the next time you get this chance? Okay, but only for a little bit. Of course. You poured the wine into the glass and sat in the chair across the desk. Well, since we're resting anyway, we could talk about something. Sure. So, you're on your own now. How are things with you? Going with you. Everything's fine. Everything is fine. I'm living like a true bachelor out here, true rock star bachelor, you know what I'm saying? Actually, I'm totally fine. Made some interesting acquaintances, got a job, almost put together a band. We can say that everything is going exactly as planned. You know, that reminds me a lot of Julia. And in unknown circumstances, you're as confident on your feet as she is. That's a very useful quality. Well, you don't want to mark it all down to me. In the end, I had a good starting condition. Yeah, I know about that. It wouldn't be wonderful if dad wasn't breaking down my neck. That's for sure. I heard from Julia that he's just waiting for you to slip up. Imagine that we have such a fun family, but let's not talk about that. Tell me what's new with you. But like I said, we're expanding significantly. Oh no, not about the work. 20 minutes later, their entire department is engaged in some kind of nonsense. If it wasn't for Julia and me, oh my God, why did I ask that? She never stops talking. Another 20 minutes later, that's it. About damn time. You, you talking up a storm. So you ain't even finished your want. I'm sorry. I loaded up you up with my problem. Just it just been a lot of pressure lately. My back is killing me. Sitting in the chair. Yo. Dang, yo. Just relax. I can give you a nice little, nice little massage on the back. You know what I'm saying? I can help with that. Yo, Kurt. Kurt is me. We the same person. He's just visual. You know what I'm saying? But yo, we the same dude. Yeah, in that way, I can give you a great massage. Can you? No doubt. We had a great massage therapist at home and who did a whole course with me. Well, look, you're not going to be very lucky if you're lying. Jane slowly began to remove the jack. Don't stare. Don't stare. Yo. We ain't the same person because I'll be... Know what I'm saying? Put these on. All you got to do is put some shades on. Kurt. And you're good. You can stay all you want. You can stay all you want with some shades on. Beauty. Oh, about the massage, the pain goes away. At the massage, you'll feel like a different person. I uh, will see. The girl lay on her stomach on the couch, leaving her back to you. I haven't massaged anyone in a while. Oh, my skills are not rusty. Hey, man, you better... I hope your hands ain't rough. If they are, you better get some lotion, some oil or something. You better ask her, yo, you got... You got some lotion around. You got some oil around. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I know. I know you be on the guitar, so I, I don't know how your hands are, man. He doing it dry. He's dry massage. Oh, yes, that's exactly what I needed. Hey, glad you like it. I still got it. Mm. Can you go a little lower? Can I go lower? <laughs> You betcha, you betcha, Jane. Sure, yes. Her skin is so soft. Yes, there, that's nice. Looks like she's really into it. Perhaps it's necessary to force the situation a little. You know, to make it even better, I like to... <laughs> it's only in the way now. Hmm, Jane? Oh, she's knocked out. Wait a minute, is she asleep? Jane? Yeah, she definitely is asleep. It looks like a small dose of alcohol, constant stress, and fatigue has done its job. I'll try to turn her over. Mm. 
I would like a real sleeping beauty. What a gorgeous body she has. I bet she spends a lot of time at the gym. Okay, what's next? All right, man, man, man. All right, y'all. All right, y'all. All right, y'all. That's one thing. I may be a sleaze, but you know what I'm saying? I ain't a creep. I ain't a creep. I ain't a creep. You know what I'm saying? So, yo. Y'all don't be, if y'all watch the other, if y'all watch the other visual now, because I mean, I'm, I don't be doing all, I'm not, I don't be doing all this, man. We just leave, man. We, we, we don't indulge in them type of activities over here. If you're a radical, we don't indulge in them type of activity. I'm not sure we should continue to tempt fate. Better go home this time. Anyway, in my opinion, this meeting went quite well. Hey, man, if she won't remember it, we'll have another opportunity, you feel me? Came home and started your usual evening routine. Beep, beep. Hmm, this is weird. Call from work? Hello? Oh, it's Anna. Kurt, I'm sorry to call so late. Are you comfortable talking? Anna, I'm listening. I know you were scheduled to be on tomorrow, but we're reshuffling the roster here. Oh? Yeah, sorry for the suddenness. Your next shift is in two days on Sunday. Hmm, we're gonna we're going to the concert on Saturday, but I'm free Sunday. Okay, I understand. Thanks for the heads up. Thank you. Anything else I can help you help you with? Hmm, that's a that's all. Good night. Good night. Two days off? Well, I can handle that. But I'm done for the day. It's time to go to sleep. Yo, that was that was a quick ass day, you know what I'm saying? You were ready to get into the bed, but once again decided to peek out the window into the building across the street. Who knows? Maybe I'll see something interesting again. Wow, not what I was expecting, but still interesting. Looks like Rosa and Selena are talking about something. Wait a minute, wasn't Rosa just going to stay with Selena for one night? <laughs> one night, huh? Oh well, I was spotted again. This trend is starting to bore me. Looks like Selena wasn't surprised to see me here. Like she was expecting it. Damn it, Rosa noticed me dead now too. As if nothing had happened, you waved to them. How beautiful you devil. Okay, now it's time to get the hell out of here. Yeah, that, that'll, that'll do. <laughs> That's what I'll do. Yeah, it's starting to get real weird after that. All right, now to sleep. Next morning, checking the drip. Same old drip, man. One thing I'll change is some shoes, man. I ain't messing with them shoes. Them shoes ain't ain't going to get going with with the shirt. You know what I'm saying? Yes, I'm finally done with my morning routine, and now I can have a little fun. Wow, it's been a while since I surfed the web. It's time to fix that. Well, let's see what we've got here. Yo, don't be going on the hub, Munchie. Relax. Ten minutes later, you have an incoming video call from Jane, 1988. Video call from Jane 1988? I wonder if that's really who I think it is. If so, what will she say after last night? Well, I guess when I'm about to find out. You're gonna leave it on that note, man. I know y'all wanna see what's gonna go down. But yo, yeah, I gotta leave y'all on a cliffhanger for this episode. You feel me? You feel me? But yo, it's your boy Rad in the building. Appreciate y'all radicals, you know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all hit that subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that like if you haven't, if you reached this far. Two, comment down below. How y'all feel about uh Selena's mom? Y'all messing with Miss Rosa? She looked like a snake to me, bro. I, I, I'm gonna keep it a stack. I ain't really trying. Lena, on the other hand. You know what I'm saying? Jane, on the other hand. Anna. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what that's what this looked like. But yo, once again, it's your boy, Rad. Appreciate y'all, dog, for coming by, stopping by, vibing with your boy on this journey once again. Also, I'll, I'm taking a lot of recommendations in the comments for more visual novels I could play since we just... You just cleaned up uh, chapter three of Summer's Gone. Hey, enough talking, enough talking, but y'all, I'm going to holler y'all next time. Peace.